Okay, this video will show you how to work with and get used to your um, tools before you come in to take the test. Again, you go down and click the practice test button. Um, you will want to go to grade six through 12 online test tutorial. Um, and then you will click start. And as you can see, it says this introduces you to test nav eight, the computer program used for online testing. It will help you learn how to navigate through tests and also how you will use the tools in the toolbar. So the first thing it's showing you is how to hit the navigation buttons here and you would click this button right here. You go up to the top and that is the next button and that takes you to the next thing. Um, before starting the test, you will be able to sign in to your test by typing in a username and password that we will give you when you get here to take the test. So then you click through. Now, this shows you all of the things on your toolbar. You have the back and next button, the review and bookmark button, gives you the test and part and what question you're on. This is the test toolbar, okay? And over here, this is accessible tools. And this video will go through uh, the rest of those. Uh, the review button at the top lets you go back and forth um, right here. You can go between any questions that you need to. Um, the bookmark button lets you mark questions to review later. So you click that um, and a blue ribbon appears to that question. And when you go there, you can see it on the review question. Um, reaching the end, it'll tell you, and the orange and blue icons tell you how many not answered and how many bookmarks you have. Uh, once you have completed and answered all questions, it will give you the check mark and you will click submit selection. Um, let's see, this is exiting and resuming the test later. If you want to sign out, you click here and you can click out and sign out a test nav and it will save you for later. Um, again, this is how you submit the test by clicking the submit final answer button at the bottom here. Um, these are all of your tools that you have. This is the pointer that you see here. This button right here is the notepad that you can type notes on while you're reading are working on, this is basically your scrap paper. Here you have the calculator. Um, that is a very basic ca calculator, but will help you answer most of the basic questions in math. Uh, this is the answer eliminator, which you will click on answers you know aren't correct. And this is the dictionary thesaurus. Um, so you look up a word, it will tell you the definition. And then if you want to click over to thesaurus, it'll give you synonyms and antonyms and things like that. Um, this is, you can read these as you go through, gives you some extra key things um, or tips on the tools that I just showed you, helps you uh, to work with them a little better uh, for the shortness of this video i just wanted to point them out to you but you can um, see different things in math you will also have a protractor that will come up on the screen you can move it up and down and you can move it to where you need to measure same way with your straight edge here you can move it to where you need shorten it lengthen it and this next thing will we'll go through all the steps that you need to do that um, and it'll tell you some things to try with your protractor same thing with your ruler and, and straight edge uh, looked at the dictionary uh, the highlighter tool uh, it, it shows you or goes through the process of how you can Highlight, it says select a few words, um, choose a color to highlight the word, and, you, and it tells you how to re remove it. 
Um, again, scrolling over here is two fingers on your um, pad down here. I'm just using these two fingers go back and forth. The glossary it, it talks about um, and, and like you said there are 22 other slides with this I, I would suggest going through um, the accessibility tools uh, change the background magnifier line reader uh, things like this if you go through this tutorial it will walk you through all of these things that you can do and it'll explain to you how to to try them so um, you know, answering, masking tool, a lot of tools um, that, that you can do through this whole process. Um, and then it tells you how to mark different questions and, and goes through the same process. The best thing for you to do is sit down and go through this whole 45 minute slide presentation. Um, if you have any questions, you can email me at brian.schooley at mccracken.kyschools.us.